Hey, what is guys? My name is Eric and welcome to yet another Premiere tutorial. This is another entry to my Premiere tutorial series where I go over some audio effects that you can do within Premiere Pro. I'm basically going to show you guys how to add some bass uh, to either like music, basically any uh, audio source. I personally use a lot of these uh, sound effects uh, in my uh, funny moments video, so I use them as a kind of a meme, as a joke to enhance the, uh, the, f the the hilarity, I guess, or the stupidity of something. So, uh, as for the very first tutorial, I'm also going to be using a clip of me saying hello. That seems to be a signature thing that I do nowadays. <laughs> Let's just um, jump into Premiere Pro and I'll show you what we are going to be doing. All right, so we are in Premiere Pro. I got my projects all sorted. I got my audio clip here. Me saying hello. Hello. Hello, <laughs> and as you can see, I've left some empty space before and after. Um, now, if you want to do some noise removal in you know, Audacity, then you can do that. Uh, just leave some uh, space in, uh, just to record like the background noise, and then you can uh, sample that and basically do some audio um, noise reduction stuff. If you want a tutorial noise reduction, you can actually do some in Premiere Pro, believe it or not. If you want a tutorial on that, then leave a comment down below, and I might just make it. I'll make a tutorial on that. Um, but they're going on a tangent as per usual So basically just have your audio here Usually you want to have some space after whatever you want to bass boost or whatever you want to have Want to add the effect on um, But with the bass boost it doesn't matter as much as it did for like reverb or the echo effect that I showed in the last episode or last uh, tutorial if you watch that I made it sound like a like a full on like film series or like a TV show series, but it's kind of not like that. But whatever, I digress. Uh, anyway, I'm just gonna cut out the front of the audio as I don't really need it. It's just dead space for me. Hello. Buddy. So we just have the hello here. Hello. Now I'm going to add uh, or like increase the volume, both in channel volume and like the overall volume. Hello. So you can hear it much cl more clearly. Now just go to effects and type in bass. Wow, really? That's all you get to do. <laughs> and then you can boost up to 24 decibels. <laughs> As you can hear, that's maybe that's it. that is what you're after. Maybe not. Um, like I know people use like bass and hands to bass boost music and songs to make them sound a bit better. Uh, because some songs are like just under, like the, the bass is really low or you just want to test out your new bass or your stereo system or whatever then you can do that and you can increase the bass here or just if you should like like most people uh that i know of like uh, songs that have a heavier bass uh be included uh but probably if you're going for something like i do like like a meme then that's that even that is kind of too much so you should like test this out and try try and fiddle with it um to kind of match your choices like I, I say this in almost every single tutorial video I do that is that has anything to do with editing and stuff just like mess around with stuff nothing is set in stone when it comes to editing you can do whatever the fuck you want like your imagination is your limit basically and I mean if you're missing an arm or two then uh, that kind of makes things a bit more difficult you know but you know <laughs> Uh, overall it's just down to your uh, imagination and what you want to do and uh, I guess the skills you've developed over time but I keep talking all right let's listen to this hello so basically with 12 it's it's still a bit loud so let's put nine hello that's a bit better six maybe hello but six seems like a normal one like you don't even have to do like a meme bass boost you can just add like plus three decibels onto your normal voice to make it sound a bit deeper or whatever. You can also do uh, EQ or equalization and then go to edit from the custom setup. From the presets go to bass enhance and that basically does it for you. You can uh, mess around with these settings as you wish. Um, Hello? That kind of sounds a bit Hello? better. Uh, but yeah, that's like the basics of it. Uh, the basics of adding bass <coughs> to sound in Premiere Pro. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, please click the button down below as it helps me out a lot. If you have any questions or suggestions for the future videos or whatever, then leave those in the comment section down below. And as always, don't forget to subscribe.